hello manufacturer i get it you would rather spend maximum amount of your time working on your cnc than cleaning out or maintaining the coolant filtration system after all that is not your main job and we have got just the thing for you our newly designed self cleaning automatic coolant filtration system if you clean out your coolant tank more frequently than you would like and hate every dirty minute of it then you are in a lot of company and we have a solution for you hi my name is ajinkya kelkar and welcome to yet another episode of the think filter show a show where we discuss about mechanical engineering products and some success stories as well if you are interested in something like this please subscribe let us take a look at a very interesting case from one of our biggest customers a multinational company making many products out of which one of their main products is making anti lock braking systems that is abs for the automotive industry their goal was to keep the grove machines on their shop floors running about 160 hours a week and most of them in lights out condition the company senior management thought and i quote the right way to think about manufacturing cost is not to look at how much the machines or its accessories cost you but how much it cost to keep them running for hour even a multi million dollar machining setup can have a surprisingly low hourly running rate if it runs round the clock each machine on their shop floor is set up to do a number of machining operations on the aluminum workpiece being a multinational company they have a huge production load as well which means a lot of aluminum fines or burr to be handled by the coolant filtration system in fact the maintenance engineers of this company identified coolant related activities as the number one root cause for lost machining hours a pump gets clogged or becomes defective or they have to dismantle the tanks underneath the machines or they have to remove the conveyors which come with the machine because sludge gets built up in it most traditional coolant filtration systems comprise of a simple paper media however such systems come with their own set of limitations like you need to keep the filter media in stock with you or you have, the maintenance people have to be engaged to uh, change the filter media from time to time plus the uh, filter media consumption increases when the production increases also the conveyor which comes with these machines usually are not capable of handling very fine dirt or very fine particles which are generated during machining these particles even escape the paper filter media sometimes and get settled down in the tank traditionally this company used to stop the machining remove the tank send someone in and scoop the dirt out and this happened periodically and this is where you lose out on your precious machining hours the company senior management and maintenance engineers told us very clearly that their primary value adding activity was to make anti lock braking system all other activities were non value adding for them and hence they wanted to eliminate them although this company understood that they require a good filtration system to make their core product however maintaining coolant and its filtration system is not a revenue generating activity for any company and hence the challenge in front of us was to provide them with a system which did not require any filter replacement and which could run without any manual intervention and we did just that now i have got something very cool to show you a game changer for any manufacturing setup no more filters no more mess related with these filters just a simple automatic self cleaning filtration system which gives instant access to clean coolant no matter how much the production volume let me show you the system is designed to handle 300 liters per minute of coolant flow with an overall dimensions of 1100 mm in width 1600 mm in length 
and about 1700 mm of, of height. The outer body is made out of mild steel and although this system is made to handle aluminium chips, similar system can be used to handle grinding sludge, steel grinding sludge, uh, brass, particles or even plastic. Some of the components that we have used in making this system is the main component is the rotary drum which is made out of eight plates which are in turn made out of a mesh of 30 micron capacity. Then it has a scraper conveyor which has a speed of about 1.5 meters per minute which is run by a 0.5 HP Bonfiglieri geared motor of a speed reduction ratio of 300 is to 1. Then it has a level sensor which gives an alarm when the coolant level inside the system reaches overflow level. And there is a piping and nozzle arrangement which is placed inside the drum to clean the mesh. Now let's see how this system works. Coolant with aluminium chips is pumped inside the system from the top. Inside the system is a continuously rotating drum with the eight plates with a 30 micron mesh on top of it. Coolant passes through the openings in the mesh while the aluminium chips are trapped by the mesh. Inside the drum is a nozzle arrangement which sprays clean coolant which removes the chips trapped by the mesh. The clean coolant spray is in the form of a pulse which is controlled using an actuated valve uh, which is in turn controlled by the PLC. The pressure for the clean coolant is generated using a pump. When the clean coolant jet is sprayed the chips fall down inside the conveyor and the scraper conveyor blades take out those chips out of the system. In designing this system, we have considered some special precautions like the pipe which is used for the incoming dirty coolant is cut at an angle at the bottom so that the coolant when it enters the system does not cause excessive foaming or there is a proximity sensor installed for the overload protection of the geared motor. And third, but the most important precaution is that we have considered a special sealing arrangement between the rotating drum and the stationary body so that the coolant only flows through the mesh and not from anywhere else. I hope you liked what you just saw and you find it useful for yourself. In fact, we are looking for a cool name for this product. If you have any suggestions, please mention in the comments below. And as you can see, I have shared all the details of how to make this system by yourself. However, if you need any help in designing this system, simply contact us. We will mention our contact details in the description below.